I'm at the house at 5102 Bright Oak and we are in the Villages of Spring Oaks subdivision. Gonna do a 360 real quick here. It's starting to rain a little bit, but uh, this is a nice cul-de-sac. So you're not gonna have a lot of traffic here. Lots of mature trees in the area. We'll take a look inside. We got a nice, I like this two car garage with separate entrances so you can line up correctly. Let's gonna take a look inside. Nice uh, bay windows in the front, some nice landscaping. This is a five bedroom, two and a half bath, 3,016 square feet roughly. This is a great size house. Nice ceramic tile floors. We've got a coat closet there, open floor plan. And I love the neutral colors. We've got nice neutral colors throughout the house and a lot of ceiling fans. Also, all the windows have blinds. This would be your, uh, let me just lay out this real quick. So over here we have the living room, living room, formal dining room. To the back and to the left is going to be the kitchen and around the corner there is going to be the family room and the entrance to the garage. So let's start here in the front. Carpets are in really good condition. So that's your living room. This will be your dining room area, formal dining. Ceiling fan, good size space. Here we have the half bath downstairs. So you have your nice uh, pedestal sink, ceramic tile, and your commode. It's a really open uh, feeling here, Look, open floor plan. We got the family room here, uh, fireplace, uh, looks like a gas uh, connection there, or gas, um, Yes, that is going to be gas. Your connection there to turn on the gas for the fireplace. Another ceiling fan. This is a very large space, uh, roughly 18 feet by about 14 feet. Here we have the uh, entrance to the two-car garage. We talked about separate entrances, uh, separate garage doors. Give you a view here. Nice open kitchen. You got an eat-in area for your informal dining. You can put a smaller table here. You got lots of cabinet space. You got gas cooking, which is perfect for people who like to do a lot of cooking. Gas stove, dishwasher, dual sinks. You got your little pantry there, and then this is your uh, refrigerator uh, ice maker hookup. Okay, off of the uh, kitchen, we got the. Let's show this here. Covered patio. So you can do your barbecuing out here. Nice fence yard, lots of nice lush grass. Good size yard. And then we're gonna head upstairs. Upstairs is the five bedrooms. Okay. We're gonna end up here last. This is the masters, this is the utility room, and then around the corners, uh, I'm not gonna swing around to all of them, but um, we'll go through each bedroom separately. We'll start at the very top of the stairs. We got the um, wash and dryer hookups. You got both gas and electric uh, hookups for the dryer. I like a upstairs utility room because then you don't have to carry the clothes downstairs, wash them and fold them and carry them back upstairs. They're already up here. All these bedrooms are oversized. They're all a great size. Uh, got another bay window here. All these bedrooms are way above average size. Your closet space, nice neutral colors throughout this whole house. So that'd be bedroom number two. Bedroom number three is, let me go back in here, is uh, about 14 feet by 13 feet. Same size as bedroom number Two, so bedroom number three, bedroom number two, about the same size. Nice walk-in closet here. To me, that's a fantastic use of space. If you're gonna have five bedrooms, you definitely want them to be all spacious so nobody's gonna be cramped. OK. 
Okay, bedroom number four. Also a good size. There's gonna be your walk-in closet there, ceiling fans. So there should be no complaints about somebody getting the small bedroom because these are all really good size. Again, same setup here. This is about 13 feet by 12 feet. So again, oversized for this many bedrooms. This will be your hall bathroom. Sink, tile floors, and your tub and shower combination. And then a little uh, linen closet there. And then we're going to head back. We'll end up with the Masters. So this Masters suite is huge. It's 19 feet by about 14 feet. It's got nice uh, 10 foot ceiling here. Ceiling fans, you got all the blinds. You can easily fit your king size, your oversized furniture, king size bed, dresser drawers, nightstands, etc. and have lots of room. You could easily make this a, a little home office in the corner here. And then we have the master bathroom. Got a nice garden jacuzzi tub, perfect for relaxing. Got the dual sinks, sitting area so you can get ready in the morning. Your separate shower and your commode here and separate shower here. And then finally, the large walk-in closet. This closet is about uh, 11 feet by 7 feet, so this is huge. So again, to summarize, this is a 5 bedroom, 2.5 bath. Square footage is roughly 3,016 square feet. If you'd like more information about this home, please call Liberty Management toll free at 1-855-347-1800. Six one again eight five five three four seven three seven six one. Thank you.